Hey dear, welcome back to our channel. Today we are here with an interesting topic, which is how touchscreen works. Basic principle. The fundamental principle of capacitive touchscreens is based on the property of capacitance. Capacitance is the ability of an object to store an electric charge. In this context, the touchscreen's capacitance changes when a conductive object, like a finger, comes into contact with the screen. Construction. Capacitive touchscreens typically consist of two main layers, a cover glass and a capacitive layer. The cover glass is the outermost layer that users directly touch, and the capacitive layer is made of a transparent conductive material, such as indium tin oxide, ITO. Transparent conductive layer. Indium tin oxide is commonly used because it is transparent and conductive. The capacitive layer is essential for creating a grid of electrodes that are responsible for detecting touch input. Electrode grid. The capacitive layer is structured in a grid pattern with rows and columns of electrodes. Each intersection point of a row and column forms a capacitive node. The grid system helps in determining the precise location of a touch event. Electric field formation. When a voltage is applied to the grid, an electric field is established across the capacitive layer. This electric field extends beyond the surface of the touchscreen. Capacitance change. When a conductive object, like a human finger, touches the screen, it disrupts the electric field at that specific point. This disruption alters the capacitance at the corresponding node. The capacitive touchscreen controller detects these changes in capacitance. Touch detection. The capacitive touchscreen controller continuously monitors the capacitance at each node in the grid. When a touch event occurs, the controller identifies the specific nodes where the capacitance has changed. By determining which rows and columns are affected, the controller can pinpoint the X and Y coordinates of the touch point. Controller processing. The information about the touch event, including the X and Y coordinates, is sent to the device's processor. The processor interprets this data and executes the corresponding action or command, such as opening an application, moving a cursor, or zooming in on an image. Advantages. Capacitive touchscreens offer high touch accuracy and responsiveness. They are also durable and resistant to scratches. These advantages have contributed to their widespread adoption in devices like smartphones, tablets, kiosks, and other touch-sensitive interfaces. OK, that's all for today. See you soon in the upcoming videos. Please subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos